Hi! Welcome to Thursday's workout. Sorry. Felt like kind of dancing move. You know, you just get it and you feel in your soul. You just kind of let it loose. Um, I changed um, backdrop. I know y'all are tired of my old couch, so I just want to change it up a little bit this time around. All right, so today is just about moving our bodies. Um, I've done a lot of work the past couple days, so we just want to get a nice little sweat and just move. We've got a imam that's going to be long and no weight. Yeah, it's just, you're just going to use your body for today. So your warm up, you're going to go through. You got a two minute jog at the beginning, just stay in place, nice and light on those toes. You'll be here for two minutes. If you want to dance it out, you want to do jumping jacks. We just want to get that heart rate up for two minutes, okay? Then you're going to go into 10 scorpions. So we're going to lay it down on the ground. Y'all have done these before, but if you have not, you're going to lay it on the ground. Let's see if I can show you guys this angle. So you lay it on the ground. You're going to twist, opposite hand, opposite toe, reaching, uh, and waking up that spine. You can push off of the ground. I can't go back because of my refrigerator. <laughs> but the whole point is to wake up that spine and um, just get that uh, opposite foot to your hand as close as possible. I know not all of us or not everybody is as flexible um, in that. So just reach as far as you can and take it nice and slow. Just waking up the body. Then we're going to go into 10 Spider-Man lunges. So you're going to walk it out like you would an inchworm and you're going to take a big step forward opening up those hips, dropping that elbow, bring it back center, walk it back, soft bend in those knees, walk it out. You got five on the right, five on the left, getting a really good hip opener right there. Then you're just gonna stand it up, feet come outside those hips, just going into 10 air squats, slow and controlled, waking up those glutes, push those hips down and back, and then we stand all the way up, okay? And then you got 10 side hops, so what that's gonna look like, so 10 total. You're gonna hop to the side, 10, 10. Act like you're hopping over a line or a cup, landing nice and soft, okay? Two times through on those four movements, you can just jog it out um, that one time, or jumping jacks, or if you need a little bit more, continue to do so. Then, we've got a 30 minute EMOM, so Every minute on the minute, you're gonna do a movement. So, but this time it's gonna look a little different because you're gonna be working for 45 seconds of that minute and then you get a 15 second rest in between. So, minute one, we've got touchdown jump. So what that is gonna look like, arms gonna be like in a field goal. You're gonna drop down into a squat position. So feet are just kind of up right underneath those shoulders. You're gonna drop down, hips down and back. Fingertips touch by those toes as you come up. You jump, reach. So you reach up to the top. So what it looks like from the height, you sit it down and you lift it up. Here, okay? Touchdown jumps for 45 seconds. I know it's gonna be a long time and that's okay. Slow it down. If you want, you reach, pop, land. Reach, pop, land. If you want a little bit of a pause in between, okay? Then you got a 15 second rest. Then, minute two, you've got five side shuffles to the right, five side shuffles to the left. So what you're gonna do is stay nice and low. If you've got a mat, just shuffle to the end of the mat and shuffle back to the end. So you're gonna stay nice and low, keep those glutes activated, side shuffle, and side shuffle back. Stay nice and low, keep that core tight. Kind of like football drills, soccer drills. We've done side shuffle before, okay? Then, Minute number three, 45 seconds of pop out burpees, meaning no push up. You're gonna pop out and in for your burpees. So I don't wanna hit that. <laughs> so stand tall, feet underneath those hips. We drop down, pop those feet out, pop those feet in and hop. Again, out and up for 45 seconds. Rest for 15 seconds. Minute four, you got air squats. So feet are up just outside those hips. Knees are out, there it is, just air squats. If you wanna add a little bit of spiciness, make them those prisoner squats by just placing those hands behind that neck or head. It'll force you to engage that core a little bit more. Here, if you wanna add that, perfectly okay. Then next up, 
You'll rest for 15 seconds. Then at number five is heel touches. So hands are up in the air, heel touches. Here, here, here. Just reaching for that toe. It's forcing you to work those lower obliques to drive that knee up and touch that heel a little closer. Boom, boom. <laughs> so working through those movements for 30 minutes. Whew, don't forget tomorrow, I will be teaching at 9 a.m. Maddie will be teaching on noon on Zoom. And then Sarah will be at 5.30 on Instagram. And then uh, Friday, we will have me at 9, of course, and then Kristen at 5.30 p.m. via Zoom. And happy hour, y'all. Join us on happy hour. We miss you guys. We do it so that we can see your faces, even if we're like 10 minutes. Hop on, say what up, and then go about your night. We love you guys. Whew, we're around that corner. I see a, we see a light at the end of the tunnel. All right. Have a beautiful day. Love you. See you soon.